Hey guys, this is going to be a weird video. I'm filming this from my iPad and it's actually pointed up at the ceiling so you can see the popcorn ceiling here in my mother's house. I just wanted to share a haul with you all today. This is from Tuesday morning and my mother, there's one near my mother's house that's like five minutes away that used to be open and they actually have moved it to a different shopping center so it's a much bigger space but um, they had a lot of craft supplies there that I hadn't seen in my own or didn't pick up in my own. So um, I picked up this craft mat. It's um, from Basil. You can see the number there. And that one is a white one instead of the tan color. And it's a 15 by 24. You can see that measurements there. So it says th it's thicker. So we'll see if that's better than the ones I have. They had tons of Prima flowers which I hadn't seen before, so I picked them up. These are $3, um, or not $3, $0.99. The retail price is $3. You can see the SKU there. So this is interesting. I'm going to be showing it to you, um, you know, facing down. So I got some white ones, too. You can see the SKU number. Um, and I got a couple of each, so... Bear with me. I got these. These were $1.50. And there's three in each pack. Pretty colors. And I got them in white. So I got those. Um, here's some that are... Um, it's like a cool gray color, I think. Or maybe the warm gray. They're kind of neutral, so... Um, there's a skew number there. I got these Seven Gypsies um, <clears throat> metal index tabs. I just got one pack, I believe, or maybe I got two. I got the flowers and the white. I got more of these Martha Stewart tags because I really like the um, print on them. Uh, I got some of these letters. Um, they were $3 each. They're from Artsy. And then there goes more flowers. These are bunches in white. Uh, this is a different style. I got these before. And then I found the punches that everybody's been picking up um, from American Crafts. And these you could see here. Here's the SKU number. And this is the star one. And it, whoops, it shows you the um, image on the back. And then I got the flower one. Same price. And there's a skew. I'm sorry if I'm holding it weird. There we go. Um, there's this one. And this is the um, tiny bow. Um, I found these stickers from Craft Market. Um, here they go. They're like a puffy sticker, but they're gold and cream. So I thought those would be nice. And then I found some wood veneer um, stickers from Maggie Holmes and from Chamel. So I'm going to try my best to show them. There you go. And so there's gold um, foil on these. There's that one. And I found these from the Chamel. These are wood. They're like rulers and it's hard to show it, but there you go. There's the SKU number there. Um, and then I found these cork ones from Chamel. Get a look at that. And then this last set is uh, wood stickers from We Are Memory Keepers. So there's that one. So you can see them all. So yeah, these are actually wood. Um, the other ones were cork. I did pick up this um, Dritz. It's a water pen, so you can use this on fabric for marking your fabric, and it will wash off. And there's the skew. Um, I did pick up some gold stickles. These are dry. Um, sorry, dry fine glitter in the gold. Um, they had a lot of other colors, but um, I just wanted the gold, so this was $1.99.
There's the skew. And some more punches. This is a circle one. And there's this. Oh, it's upside down, isn't it? Is that right? Yep. Got to remember to turn it the right way. And then this is the heart one. I don't know if I have this one. I think I might. If I do, I will just um, gift this to a friend. Um, excuse the phone. I'm not going to answer it. I did buy some grid paper, which I've been looking for um, without the holes to make some Fedori notebooks with the grids. Um, and this is from Seth Cole. There is, uh, these are eight and a half by 11 and, um, it's 20 pound paper. So I got a couple of those and then I got one pack of paper that's 12 by 12. And this is from, who is this by? This is from Pebbles, from me to you. That's the line and it's called Notes. So this is the back of the paper, and sorry for the glare. Um, lots of little cut-aparts there, little cut-apart Polaroids. But the reason I bought it was for the gingham. And where is the sticker? Oh, here. So you can see the SKU number. And I believe this is a 25 pack of 12 by 12. And then the last two things I got were this Ot Light, which actually I've been looking for another one, but this is not exactly the one I was looking for. Um, so I got this one, and you can see the style here. It has a small base, and then it, it can telescope up. So I got that, and then the last thing I got is a selfie stick, and I'm going to actually use this not for selfies, because I don't take selfies, um, more for, I'm going to try and do hook this up to um, my tripod so I can do maybe tutorials, um, but that won't be until I get into the new studio. I just don't have room to set up a tripod in my craft, my craft room now. This is the kind that has the little um, remote on it. So my husband is going to try and hook this to my one of my tripods that I have for my regular camera um, and see if that works because I, I, I film on my phone most of the time. So we're going to try that out and see if it works. But that is my haul, and I hope you like it. Talk to you soon. Bye.